So live visuals uh, there of uh, U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin, who is in India and is uh, being welcomed. In fact, uh, uh, the welcome with a guard of uh, honor, and you can see those live visuals on your television screens of uh, the U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin, who is in India and in fact is uh, being welcomed with a guard of honor. Right. In fact, uh, the U.S. Defense Secretary uh, Lloyd Austin has uh, arrived. In fact, uh, he arrived in India on Sunday, is now being welcomed uh, with a guard of honor. So a ceremonial welcome uh, for the U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin in India. And we are displaying those live uh, visuals of uh, the U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin uh, with the uh, India's uh, Defence Minister Rajnath Singh and in fact uh, Lloyd Austin is on a two-day visit to explore further ways to further strengthen bilateral defence cooperation, especially in areas of uh, transfer of critical technologies for co-development of military hardware. Now remember Austin's uh, visit comes over two weeks uh, ahead of Prime Minister Modi's state visit to Washington. And we are displaying those live visuals of uh, the ceremonial welcome being given to the U.S. Defense uh, Secretary Lloyd Austin. So the U.S. Uh, Defense Secretary receiving the guard of honor. Remember, he's on a two-day uh, visit. Center in Delhi, and this is a short but a very crisp and important meeting which both the ministers will be holding. They will be discussing the forthcoming uh, events in United States about the innovations and collaborations by both the countries, and they will also be discussing the strategic ties, the military ties between both the nations, and how Prime Minister Narendra Modi will be holding very important meetings in United States in his uh, visit, which starts uh, around 22nd of June and thereafter the events that will be commencing in the United States. We know that United States and India are strong partners of the Quad and they have been conducting drills in the Indian Ocean region and also on land we've seen in Oli how the Yudhabhyas was uh, going on between India and United States close to the LAC. And if we talk about the LAC issue also, 
US has been supportive of India in terms of supplying uh, with the winter clothing, the other things, and also speaking on the global forum for India. And uh, today, when uh, the Defence Secretary from the United States and Defence Minister Rajnath Singh meet, they will be certainly discussing the uh, uh, situation along the borders and also the Indian Ocean region and how India is uh, handling the situation. And not only this, the important partnership between India and US in terms of collaborating in, uh, uh, for the engines of Tejas that are being made in India and they will be made together by the transfer of technology from GE and uh, HAL in India. Because we know there's a lot of focus on made in, make in India for the defense. In India, we've seen uh, the list of uh, equipment that will be not imported from the countries, but it will be made in India. So all these innovations will also be discussed out here. And so many equipment and weapons that are now made in India are also being made for the world. So United States is also interested in a lot of innovation that's taking place in India, including the drone systems that are being developed in India. So a lot is to be discussed out here in this meeting that is starting shortly, as we've seen how the Defense Secretary after his guard of order has proceeded in the Manikshah Center. Absolutely. Uh, uh, like my colleague Shivani was pointing out, the U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin is uh, uh, on a two-day visit and he will be exploring ways to further strengthen the bilateral defense cooperation, uh, especially in areas of transfer of critical technologies for co-development of military hardware. Remember, Austin's trip comes over two weeks ahead of Prime Minister Modi's state visit to Washington, during which the two sides are expected to unveil initiatives to expand the India-US Global Strategic Partnership. All right, we're now getting some breaking news that's coming in.